Hey guys, Nurse Mike here and welcome to SimpleNursing.com. Check out our brand new app and get access to our new pharmacology and med surge mastery courses. Plus, a massive quiz bank loaded with detailed rationales to test your knowledge. Join for free. Click the link in our description below. Now for thrombolytics, our clot busters, our atomic bomb, the most powerful one-time push-only drugs. Key term, clot busters. So the names include TPA and those ending in ACE, like Altapase or Retilpase or even Streptokinase. Guys, these are the only ones that dissolve clots. Aspen and Clopidogrel are not clot busters. They're antiplatelets. Heparin and Warfarin, not clot busters. They only prevent new clots and existing clots from getting bigger. Now these clot busters can only be given between a three to four and a half hour window from the onset of the signs and symptoms. So the window is very narrow. And guys, the big caution here is it's massive bleed risk and it's the most deadly. So guys, make sure no injections at all. Key terms, no IVs, no sub Qs, no IMs, and definitely no ABGs. These drugs can only be given through a compressible site, like a peripheral IV. So guys, we never give clot busters through a central line where you can't hold pressure, only through peripheral IVs that can be compressed. Now the absolute contraindications because of the big risk for hemorrhaging, we avoid giving to any patients with number one, an active bleed, like key term, peptic ulcer. Number two, uncontrolled hypertension. Anything 180 over 110 or higher. Number three, recent surgery within two weeks. Big key term right there. Always clarify prescription with provider. Huge on NCLEX and exit exams, since our number one priority is patient safety. And then lastly, the three A's. Accidents or recent traumas. A for aneurysm or history of hemorrhagic CVA, aka a brain bleed from a stroke and A for AV malformations. Thanks for watching. For our full video and new quiz bank, click right up here to access your free trial. And please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel. Last but not least, a big thanks to our team of experts helping us make these great videos. All right guys, see you next time.